The principle of impulse is a very important one in sport. Basically, it's force times time. And what we mean by that is the amount of force we apply to something over a period of time will affect the impulse that that object has. And that in turn affects its momentum. So if we watch Mr. Bullen hitting the ball just here, we can see that he applies a large force to the ball over an extended period of time. This is why we see athletes follow through with their swing or kick, and that's so they can gain a greater amount of impulse. That gives the ball more momentum, meaning it's going to travel quicker to its destination, hopefully beating its opponent. Momentum is mass times velocity, and it's simply the amount of motion a moving object has. So if something is very heavy and it's traveling quickly, it has a large amount of momentum. Think about a massive great big articulated lorry, for example, traveling at 100 kilometers an hour. It has an awful lot of momentum and therefore has a lot of trouble stopping. In sport, we see momentum when we hit something or kick something or throw a ball. We have to apply the velocity through it to it through force because we can't alter the mass of something during a competition. So the harder we hit something, the greater velocity it will have and therefore the more momentum it has. And we can even link this to Newton's second law which is force is mass times acceleration.